Then I have Milani's Rose Hip Lipstick. I've I depotted it. I guess depotted, de-sticked it. I don't know. Um, and this, I use this a lot in my videos. Um, it's really bright pink. And I'll swatch it here. Super bright. Super pretty. Right, that is love that, and I have Real Tech Neek base set right here from um, I think, yeah, Samantha Chapman from Pixie Moon. Um, they have a YouTube channel, her and her sister is Sam and Nick. Um, they're two sisters who share a YouTube makeup um, channel here on YouTube and they are awesome um, this I have two sets of these matter of fact for um, when one is uh, dirty or being or drying um, I have one that's ready to go um, this right here is a detailer brush I use this to apply um, lipstick this is a foundation, a pointed foundation brush. Um, I use this for concealer. I find it to be too small for a concealer brush. Um, this is a buffing brush. I use this to apply powder. It's just like a, almost like a small kabuki um, with a long handle. And finally, this brush right here. It is a contour brush, and this is the reason why I bought um, this set was because of this brush. I didn't want to spend all the money for the Mac brush. I don't even remember um, the number to it, but um, it contours like a dream. So yeah, so worth it. And then I got it when it was buy one get one half off at Ulta. And then it had like um, free shipping over $25. So I got a really, really good deal on these brushes. So I have two sets of those. Uh, moving on to other brushes. Um, my Sigma, I have the set of Sigma brushes. But the ones that I tend to go to first is this small angle brush, the E65. Um, this brush is meant, I guess, mostly for um, applying cream liners, but I find that the hair, and I don't know if you can tell, the tip, I think is too wide for me personally. So I use it to, anytime I have to cut a crease, this is it's like using a pencil, it, it, it moves so easily if I need to smudge or smoke out a line. This is perfect for that, or even you know, doing small work, um, adding a little highlight to the around the tear duct. And this uh, brush here, the F70 concealer brush, um, I use this when I'm sculpting sculpting my eyebrows. It is perfect for that. Um, sculpting my eyebrows, get all up underneath that. Um, it. It looks perfect and I'm done. Alrighty, moving on to oh Rimmel. And now I can't find it. My Rimmel. Oh. Alright, moving on to my Rimmel Glam Eyes Lash Flirt Volume and Lift Mascara in Black. This hair, pretty packaging there. Um, I like this because I have very stingy eyelashes, and this little wand right here. Hopefully, you can see. 
see that it is perfect for getting in my eyelashes and separating and coating them even on the bottom I have issues with that but this is perfect for my eyelashes moving on to this here Jane Ising and the color is brownie points I've had this forever um I want to say I've had this for maybe 15 years I know I know it's probably gross and full of bacteria what what have you but it is the perfect brown uh chocolate brown really really deep rich brown I haven't found a brown like it look at that and it's so multi I use this um as an eyeshadow I use it um for my brows if I use um a powder to fill in my brows I also use it and even though it's really really dark I use it to contour um my cheeks um it is perfect it blends out like a green it is a the perfect brown shade of brown for me all right after brown brownie points I have hip L'Oreal's hip uh, cream eyeliner in black everybody uses this um, creamy and black stays on beautifully I create the most perfect cap um, winged out cat line with it all right and then my lashes natural response natural plus lashes made with 100% human hair these are my favorite lashes and unfortunately I can't find them but one place and the shipping is so expensive on the site. I can only find them at samsbeauty.com. They run for like a dollar fifty, a dollar fifty nine, something like that. And but the shipping is so expensive. Like it's free over seventy dollars I believe. I believe shipping is free but I just want the lashes. So I think the shipping like I tried to get it one time it was like seven dollars shipping. And I just wanted maybe ten dollars worth of lashes, so these are my go-to's. Um, I can use them over and over. They're dirty now, um, but I'm going to clean them, and they snap back in shape. I can use them literally um, up to ten times if I take care of them and remove all the glue and gunk. They go on like a dream. They are. They blend into your natural lashes so nicely all right and to apply um, those lashes or any lashes that I have on hair hand I always use um, these type of tweezers like a scissor style tweezer um, I don't know what it is about these kind of tweezers these are from lacrosse I know Revlon has some or you can just get any any kind I've also found a pair on eBay one time um they just go on like that and then you just it's just so easy to work with I don't know ergonomic would you call it um very feels very natural in the hand